Hello Virgo, how are you? Welcome to my channel, Star 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 and welcome to your reading. So Virgo, this is your reading for the month of March uh, 2022 and this is a general reading. Check what resonates and leave what doesn't. Energies might be vice versa and time is fluid, okay? Virgo, I would appreciate if you would hit like, share and subscribe and comment down below if you find yourself getting resonated with this reading. I would also request you to hit that notification bell so that you will be notified whenever I upload the videos. There is an extended reading for this one and if you are interested in the same, if you are excited to know what your person truly thinks and feels about you, what action they will take towards you, what is the likely conclusion between you and this person, you can go ahead and you can check out the link in the description box and comment section. Okay, as far as this reading on YouTube is concerned, we'll see what is your energy, what is the energy of the person you're thinking about, you're dealing with, or you will be dealing with. And I'm going to pull out some additional tarot cards and we'll see how does your money, your career, your finances look for the near future. Okay, so Virgo, let's get started now. Wow, we have Emperor for you, then we have Hermit, interesting, then we have Page of Cups and we have Eight of Swords, okay, then Four of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles, Hanged Man and Queen of Pentacles for your person. Let me pull out some additional cards for your career and your money. So many cards. Spirit. <clears throat> Four of Swords. Then we have Seven of Cups. We have the Hanged Man. The Wheel of Fortune. And Temperance. Nice. So, look, Virgo, you may be dealing with, uh, you may be dealing with an Aries, you may be dealing with a Virgo, another Virgo, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, you may be dealing with Pisces, uh, Sagittarius, if the sign pops up, uh, all the better, let's not remain fixed from the signs, Pisces is coming out as very strong, okay? So, this is your spread. Emperor, then we have Hermit, we have uh, Page of Cups and Eight of Swords. Hmm. With the Hermit card next to Emperor Virgo, your higher self is calling you, okay? Uh, Emperor is an energy which is more of a 3D, okay? It's more of uh, what is going on in and around me. I believe in what I see, okay? It's more of someone who is more in touch with the reality, more in... Someone who, someone who believes more in what they see and someone who is trying to seek evidence for everything. So if they see something, they believe in that. If they don't see, then this person probably, they may or may not believe in certain things. Like this person uh, with an emperor energy, probably you were someone who was not inclined towards spirituality but over a period of time or whatever life experiences you have had especially experiences uh, the the experiences that you gained through relationships because of the because of those experiences you are becoming a spiritually inclined person okay so there is a transformation from emperor to hermit okay so it's like it's like your higher self is asking you to look beyond what you can see, to look beyond the 3D reality. The higher self, self is asking you to trust the fact that there are higher forces or there is something 
something bigger and something better that is meant for you but this bigger and better can happen once you start once you lift that wheel of 3d 3d world okay you need to lift the wheel and you need to see what is there behind that wheel okay so that you have to go deep within your inner self is calling you okay your inner self is asking you now it's time for you to start walking towards your higher self okay your higher self is your destiny okay and so how you can do that how you can do that how you can start walking down that journey towards your higher self okay I'm not saying you are not a believer in spirituality. In fact, like I told you, because of whatever life experiences you have had, you have started believing in uh, believing in real uh, in spirituality. You have started believing in. Some of you are becoming religious, okay. But it's more of. It's more about. It's more about you have to do some sort of soul searching, okay? Uh, maybe someone underestimated you in the past, Virgo, okay? Or many a times you may have noticed that many people starting from your childhood, like your family members, your siblings, your parents, or maybe your childhood friends, and even after growing up, people in and around you, that also includes your friends or anyone else, your roommates and etc., you have noticed that at various phases in your life people sort of underestimated you and that sort of triggered something inside you like no don't underestimate me okay i know i'm a fucking capable person i know that i am able to do everything and achieve a lot in my life so that whoever underestimated you you sort of you sort of decided to prove yourself and to prove to the rest of the world that you are a highly capable person so what happened is like you sort of you are doing good right now when it comes to your materialistic abundance or you will do very good when it comes to your uh, career and your professional goals and everything in fact you are meant to become this emperor you are meant to become the uh, you are meant to reach the top but what has happened is during this journey <clears throat> of trying to achieve these goals and why you are trying to achieve these goals probably because uh, people underestimated you in the past and now you are in this in this on this journey of proving yourself and uh, proving everyone else wrong and you are also trying to prove yourself that yes i am a capable person yes you are you definitely are a fucking capable person but in this journey what has happened is you probably may have ignored your emotional needs and emotional requirements okay you probably have lost a touch base with your own inner self you probably have lost yourself in the journey somewhere okay and now with the hermit next to the emperor it's time for you to take some break it's time for you to if not a long break take intermittent breaks and give time to yourself give time to your own emotional needs and requirements give time to what makes you happy and what notice what makes you happy and do those things okay the emperor is a person where though this person sits on the throne though this person has lot of powers and though this person is a king of kings okay and this person has many people under him working for him and he keeps on commanding or he keeps on guiding other people he is always considered as a leader and you are embodying this energy of emperor but look at this emperor okay he's sitting on this throne wearing this armor so tightly and it's like he's hiding something behind this behind this a uh, lobe whatever his or uh, robe whatever he is uh, wearing okay he is hiding something behind this and what is he hiding there is there is a crushed mind there is a broken heart okay something like so many wounds this person is carrying inside him probably those wounds are unhealed and with a hermit next to the emperor it's like your your higher self your inner self is sort of asking you to now now take time to look after yourself now take time to uh, you know start walking that journey which you should start walking okay 
so you are being asked to become more self aware okay you are being asked to take care of your own emotional needs and wants you have done lot of things for other people so far virgo you have taken care of other people okay emperor is the one who keeps on taking care of other people okay but it's time for you to take care of yourself it's time for you to find yourself somewhere you have lost yourself in this journey okay and that's that's the key message over here it's time for you to find yourself it's time for you to relax it's time for you to give time to yourself it's time for you to start walking down in the direction of your higher self there is a purpose for you there is a life purpose yes probably helping out other people or achieving certain goals and whatever you are doing right now that is one of your life purposes but then there is a bigger purpose after this and it's time for you to start walking down and probably the bigger purpose is to excel in spirituality okay the big, uh, the bigger purpose is your spiritual ascensions to gain some wisdom to to become uh, to become to become an ascended soul hermit is also an ascended soul okay so to become that ascended soul in your life and then help out many people in ascension probably that is one of your uh, life purposes as well okay so maybe for some of you you guys have multiple life purposes okay this is a very intense reading virgo okay so page of cups and eight of swords yes you are hiding something inside you virgo there is something that needs to break away there is something that is deep rooted within you okay there is something that needs to be healed there is something you need to show love to yourself probably there is a lack of self love and if you are saying like why am i attracting toxic people because there is a lack of self love there is something that you need to heal even as of now okay and love is coming you don't even worry about love love will happen in fact you will find someone who is as mature as you are but before that i would suggest you heal yourself okay healing yourself taking care of yourself is rather more important than finding love love will happen automatically once you start healing yourself once you start uh taking care of yourself because universe is not like a uh, universe is not like like if you are not taking care of yourself at that point of time i'm going to send love in your life okay love is not there to take care of you love doesn't enter in your life to take care of you love enters in your life so that in anyone's life not just your life in anyone's life so that you can experience the true blessing or the true bliss and the true joy of that love or that relationship okay as far as as far as your person is concerned we have four of pentacles and 10 of pentacles hanged man and queen of pentacles someone's marriage is breaking down over here okay or someone is is separated from their partner right now we have hanged man next to 10 of pentacles and we also have queen of pentacles like this person is sitting in abundance but this person is sad about something okay they are thinking about a past relationship maybe this is a past person as well the virgo this can be a past person for you uh, for some of you yes uh, a new person will also enter in your life uh, but this new person is going through something right now like they are breaking away from a connection right now yes this person is single but maybe this person have recently broken away from a connection or they have recently got divorced or they are separated from their spouse right now and this person is sad about it they are sad about it so both of you are mirroring the energies like you also need some healing this person also needs some healing but let me tell you this connection whenever this connection happens it it, it is going to be a very strong connection virgo okay it it is like i am also hearing meet me halfway so it is not <clears throat> compulsory for both of you that you heal uh completely and then only get into a relationship so it's like even if you start the process of healing and even if you feel like you are somewhere in the midst of that journey and you find this person and you like them don't 
just go with the flow i would like to say if you feel like you should go ahead and get into connection with that person go ahead and get into connection okay uh don't go against the flow it may also happen because why i'm saying why i'm hearing this meet me uh, halfway is because probably you guys will experience spiritual sex okay tantric sex is a very strong possibility in this connection and tantric sex is something where both of you will be able to heal one another to a great extent because of that tantric sex because of the spiritual sex that you will experience okay a very strong possibility possibility that through tantric sex or spiritual sex you guys will will heal one another during that act okay right so as far as your money is concerned your career is concerned we have temperance wheel of fortune hanged man seven of cups and seven of swords some of you are considering choices with respect to career or you have a choice regarding something some of you guys are contemplating something with the four of swords and seven of cups maybe you 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 have certain options in front of you like maybe you want to go back to school and uh, then start something of your own or you want to switch from job to business or you want to switch from one job to another okay you are contemplating about something there are choices in front of you uh, and what i see with the hanged man is you are trying to take a different perspective okay like maybe you were hooked on to certain ideas in the past like this is what i want to do and this is what i want to achieve but you are trying to analyze like whatever i wanted to do in the past does it fit well in my current reality or does it, uh, do i envision doing something that in the future okay you were quite fixated about a certain idea in the past okay maybe you had a dream of going back to school and now you are revisiting that thought you are like do i really want to go back to school does it fit in my current reality do i envision that i will be able to do something value additional to my life if i go to that school and because of that i will it will create some value addition to my career is it really going to happen like that okay so you are trying to evaluate something you are evaluating the choices okay with the wheel of fortune amazing changes are coming your way please do not avoid those because i'm sensing there is a bit of a tendency on your part or someone's part uh to avoid changes or to to be bit reluctant towards changes okay because any kind of change is whatever change is coming your way is going to create uh, is going to restore the required balance money is increasing money is increasing money making opportunities may come your way okay All right I hope this resonates and hit like share and subscribe and comment on below or go the link for the extended is in description box and comment section and we'll see we'll see uh we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you what action they will take towards you what is the likely conclusion between you and this person okay all right bye bye then